Andreas, we're standing here at Toon. Tell me, what was everyone doing here today at Toon? Well, the Toon group of banks is an informal group of banks that uh, discusses uh, human rights, due diligence of banks and what they should do to implement the Ungani principles. And they put out a paper which argued that banks can only be directly linked to human rights violations but never contribute to them. And this has massive consequences because it means they're not obliged under the, they would not have been obliged uh, to provide remedy. And this paper basically outraged the global business and human rights community and this is why everyone is here now to discuss with the banks uh, on their position that cannot be defended. And how was the mood today? What happened today? Actually it was a very good discussion, much better than I expected. Somehow the banks uh, showed signs of understanding that this paper was a bit off topic. Sometimes it was rather weird because they said, oh we didn't mean it like this, we didn't want to say that we can never be uh, contributing to a human rights impact, although this is very clear in the text. But anyway, it's a sign that they probably are going to revise the paper and take all the expert advice they got today into account. And what would you expect as the next steps following today? Well, the most important thing is that there is a written commitment of what they are going to change, uh, that they clearly relativize the importance of that discussion paper that should not be in the discussion anymore after today's uh, discussions, and that they also uh, work on their processes because already three years ago we were here and they promised us a stakeholder engagement strategy that never happened. And if the banks really want to move on business and human rights issues, they have to engage stakeholders, they have to talk to stakeholders, and they have to make sure that they take the views of the rights holders that are affected by their financing into account. Thank you.